Are you guys here ready to check the Mach-E co-pilot? Yeah? All right, let's get it done. Come on, wait. We gotta open it up. Come on, let's see if we can open it up. Up you go. Okay. You guys chill out. We're gonna test this co-pilot. Hank and Luna decided that they wanted to see just exactly how the Mach-E co-pilot works on back roads. So I asked them, here they are. Luna, you ready? Hank, are you ready? Awesome, well I think they're ready to go. We're gonna take it for a ride here on some preset course. It's about a five mile long road. We're going to run the Copilot 360, which I believe is what it's called. Uh, it is, uh, I believe, 45 miles an hour. We're going to set the speed for 45 miles an hour and see if it changes speeds automatically or what have you. But you're going to see what I'm going to see because this is the first time I've done this. So let's get on the road here. All right, here we go. We're going to set it to uh, the speed limit of 50. And we're going to uh, co-pilot. On. Okay, we're at 50. Copilot is acquired. This section of the five mile road is uh, relatively straight. We'll start getting into some curves up ahead. And I think we dropped to 45 up here a little bit. So far so good. Slowing down, we were going down a slight hill, now we're uh, back to it. Co-pilot's wobbling around a little bit here. Now we're about in the center of the lane. Now we're going down a good sized hill. We'll probably end up having to uh, regen or break or whatever it does here. Okay, speedometer uh, should change now to 45 right here. Okay, and the autopilot's uh, lowered to 45 now. Copilot's still doing its thing. First turn, going downhill slightly. Come on, get back in the middle of the road. Here we go. Okay, now this is a relatively sharp turn. I don't know what'll happen. Nothing will happen. Oh, jeez. Sorry, Hank. Sorry, Luna. Had to take over. We were going straight right through that turn. Okay, hopefully it'll acquire again here now. There we go. We're acquired. Well, and we lost it again. All right, let's get around this turn here. Okay. Now we are heading west, uh, just so everybody knows. Come on, acquire. Okay, there it goes. Uh, Copilot has uh, acquired. We're going through some turns here. All right. Kind of going downhill slightly here. starting a downhill left turn. You're going to make it? Nope. It bailed out right in the apex of the turn. Uh, without intervention, we'd be in the weeds. So we're going back to the right here now. Okay. Oh, 
hopefully it'll acquire. Come on, you can do it. There it goes. Okay, so now we're uh, acquired again. Left turn, downhill slightly. Come on, you can do it. Okay, did a good job. Okay, now this is a little chicane here. It's marked at 35. And uh, I don't know. Uh, nope. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Dogs are getting thrown around here. All right, come on, acquire now. And I won't acquire in a turn. We got to get some straight going before it'll acquire. Come on, you can do it. Come on, there it goes. Okay, so we've acquired again. Doing the speed limit of 45 or 46 or whatever it's trying to do here. Applying brakes now or regen or something. Now we're uh, going downhill slightly. Still acquired. Get my hand on that wheel. And we're uh, got to go around a uh, turn here. Uh, well marked, of course. Looks good. All right, it liked it. Now we're going up a slight hill, and right at the top of the hill is a crossroad, uh, and you're visible from both directions, but the uh, road falls away here. Let's see what happens. Nope, it blew it. It uh, didn't see it over uh, as it came over the hill. Okay, we're back acquired again, and we're just about at the end of our five miles. It's applying brakes or regen, I can't tell. Um, but we're maintaining the 45 mile an hour speed limit here. And uh, another 100 yards and uh, we've concluded our test. All right, well that uh, kind of does it for our test here. Looks like uh, we've got some going home traffic. Essentially what I've seen is uh, Copilot doesn't appear to have any knowledge of uh, how bad the turn is or how steep the turn is. Uh, I should say Copilot doesn't have any knowledge of the radius of the turn and uh, that's a hindrance because it maintains the same speed. I'm assuming with updated software it might improve. We'll run it again uh, when I get some new software here. But for now, uh, you saw what I saw with Copilot handing my test road. Thank you for watching uh, this little demonstration. Uh, I picked a country road by random. Uh, I will uh, attempt to find other uh, lane-keeping, uh, lane-following, autopilot-type cars and run that same road, and uh, you guys can see how they do, too. And if you'd like to buy yourself a Tesla, the referral link shown at the bottom of the screen gets you 1,000 miles or 1,500 kilometers of free supercharging. All right. Did you guys have fun? Yeah? Did you? Hank, Hank, Hank. Did you guys have fun? All right, let's go. Okay, did you guys learn something today? Yeah, did we? Did we learn something today? Awesome.